it has been a long time this is my first video um, I think in two years and uh, there's been a lot of changes happening I'm up here in Pai, up north in Thailand. I'm staying right now at um, Reverie Siam Hotel. Uh, it's a place I have been to a few times now. Beautiful place, I'm gonna show you around. Really recommend to come here and relax um, instead of staying in the city center of Pai. It's been um, two years since my last video, way too long and I know um, a lot of you guys have been waiting for the next video to come out and you've been asking me over and over again when is the next video coming out. Um, but yeah, I got, um, you know, I had a time where I had to do um, some um, personal power up again the last two years. It's also been a lot of work, of course. So I wanted to share a few things uh, why I've been away for two years. Uh, I mean, it's, damn, it's been a long time. But yeah, there's been some changes. Um, I had uh, kind of a big life event, uh, at least for me, that uh, took me down a little bit. Um, some of you may know um, a relationship brutally got killed off. So um, that was a surprise. Um, and the thing is, um, you know, especially for me, and I know I don't know if this is a Libra thing, but you know, I, I know that Libras have a way of connecting deep with people, and I do that myself. So this took me pretty hard down, <clears throat> and um, because I'm the kind of guy that if I do allow, especially in a personal relationship with a lady, it needs to be you know it needs to be a girl with a brain um, that think for themselves, you know, disconnected out from the norms. And, and it needs to be someone that um, I would say it's more connected to their spirituality and, and see what's going on in the world. Uh, you know, and that's hard to find. It's really hard to find um, a relationship like that. Some of you know what I'm talking about. It's been a topic uh, also in our tribe at times. So, so that's why it really, yeah, it took me down a little bit when I lost what I thought I had. And um, so I had to get back in on track on on Taekwondo uh, workouts, training, meditation, uh, reading a bunch of stuff, especially on the topic like the topic of reality shift and what's possible to do in your life. Spent a lot of time on that. So it you know some you know it summed up to two years with um, uh, spending time on my business and also to power up myself. So that's mainly the reason why I've been gone for, for so long time. I wanted to share a little bit about the business side of things. What is this pale Viking from the north doing in Thailand? Um, I got two main camps. Um, first of all, I run a website called motioneffect.com. That's kind of more where, it, where you know it all started. I got a blog there. Um, got some free downloads. And I do mindset coaching. Um, I focus on reality shifts. I go really deep with spirituality and uh, metaphysical concepts and topics and I wake uh, people up to see what the hell is really going on on the planet so people can understand their lives better and then make choices and navigate around all the fuckery that's going on and, and you know basically just uh, take charge of their own reality and create the world that they want um, so that's what I do in one camp and uh, with that I'm running a community called the Creators Tribe 
and uh, you can find that on creatorstribe.one something we will rebuild this year the website and uh, finally put some more attention to this um, community which basically just started in as a small group of people that has been followers for some time uh, we really want to expand that because so many people are reaching out and and want to kind of get away from the madness and um, they are thinking for themselves they are see a big, seeing a big, bigger picture and they need like-minded people to connect with so that's what we do there um, the other camp that I'm doing is like some of you know would be would be a web design uh, I've been a web designer for so many years now and it's been my kind of main income and main business this is the way I can have my freedom and um, I have been working in such a way that um, customers stay for a long time and I basically live on a reputation um, so I get so much work sometimes that I just can't keep up uh, I'm going to change that, that this year um, and focus more on my own projects and kind of more interesting web design projects So anyway, that's kind of the two camps I have. I do mindset coaching, and um, sometimes I blend them because some some of the people that come to me, they want a life change. They want to they want to improve their life. They want more freedom. They want to be able to live kind of the lifestyle that I have done for so many years. So one of the ways they can do that is to um, work online and do web design. Um, doing web design is just one of the easiest ways. To work from anywhere and uh, to earn even passive income which I've done for so many years so that's why I also work on helping people who want to learn how to become a web designer how they can do it with no coding skills no design skills and um, that is a free guide and uh, I also have a book an ebook you can go and get on on my website yeah that's mainly my business areas my two main camps and um, loving the lifestyle I have built around this and also now trying to help people to have some of the same But you know when we have this type of lifestyle you know we also have to take care of our energy and um, that kind of pencils me a little bit into the mindset coaching because that's when I tell people that it matters what you feed your mind it matters what you feed your body uh, with food um, it matters who you spend time with and what kind of people you allow to influence your life and it matters where you hang out in the city in what home do you live in uh, what country do you live in you may not belong there anymore wherever you are so it's important that you take care of your energy and um, it's also why you know we come to the place like this to really tune out a little bit tune in focusing on you know our business get motivation so yeah so this is all the reason um, you know we're coming here to um, to pie we uh, will love staying here at the um, Reverie CM Hotel. Uh, they got some really lovely people working here. The staff is wonderful. Food is great. Uh, coffee is great. And it's just really peaceful. And the area, the hotel itself, is built in this old English vintage style. Um, very calm and peaceful. Beautiful rooms. Um, there's two pools that you can take advantage of. Um, we go and get massage treatment. We have a really nice uh, place for that here, uh, just close to the Reverie Hotel. The same hotel is called Sapaya Spa. Wonderful staff there. Uh, it's a really interesting place with a um, 
Thai couple that runs this place and they have so much knowledge in traditional and natural Thai medicine also. So it's, uh, it's a wonderful place to come to and uh, um, I love to spend some time there, uh, reset the body energy and um, have some tea and then get back on track. So what is the plan for my business this year? Um, I wanted to mention a couple of things there. So like I said, when it comes to mindset coaching and Creators Tribe, uh, that's one. That's something we go are going to, to um, put more energy into this year. And we're going to rebuild the website and we're going to make this more visible for people so that more people can find bright minds that think for themselves and want to get out of the norms and, and build a better life. Um, I will also reduce the number of client jobs that I take on and put more time into teaching people how to work online, how to do web design specifically, including workshops where I personally teach and train people how to get started building websites and get well paid for that. <laughs> 